we got one beautiful tool and the name of that tool is Adobe Photoshop. And at that time when we got that tool, many people who are without background in art and design and without professional training in art and design said, okay, from now on, I'm going to be, be creative and I'm going to do some, I'm, start, I'm going to start to design, etc. And then many people got the impression actually that uh, Photoshop is just, you put something in, you put some photo in and then Photoshop do everything for you. And that, that bias is, I'm afraid that that bias is now we have, and actually, and you know that from advertising world, you know, people started to, uh, I would say, uh, 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 underestimate or kind of to look from the high, you know, like, ah, that's, that, 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 that you did that with a, with like some, I don't know, like computer programs, you know, applications, etc. you know, especially old generation of, for example, graphic designers or product designers. And then slowly, slowly, everybody accepts that. And now it's standard. I think that that is happening also with artificial intelligence.